what's going on guys welcome back to another video in this one i'm going to be showing you how to make a pretzel stand or a soft pretzel i mean whichever one you call it i call it a soft pretzel stand okay that's awfully loud <laughs> a little too loud for my liking so yeah this is kind of my pretzel um it's not the best thing in the world but it's also not the worst thing in the world you can open the door no way did i forget to put a lever on the inside no, I didn't. I th thought I might have. Here's your little interior, and yeah, the string is kind of ugly. They need to create some ways where you cannot see this. Like, more so, at least. Especially when it's a 9 by 7 And the materials you'll be needing are polished andesite. Oak fence. Polished andesite slabs. String, red wool, white wool, iron door, lever, and oak planks. You also need one smooth stone block to put under the door. But yeah, that's pretty much everything for your exterior of the build, except for stone brick stairs. Start the front left hand corner of your building counting right, or going right, you want to place nine polished andesite. Move backwards with five, five, yes. Move left with three, then place an iron door, then four more polished andesite. It's important that it's on this block or it can be, l it can be, towards the right from the inside by one more block but don't I don't, don't even know what's happening but because the pop or the popcorn pretzel machine thing is here and take this poster inside and co connect it forward on top of the front left and front right hand polished and insides you can place three oak fences moving up you can place red carpet on each one And then come to the back wall, which should be this, and you want to place three rows of polished andesite on, on the along the entire back wall. Should be two rows above the doors. You're gonna want to bring it forward on the left and right by two rows. And you're gonna want to fill in the roof on top with polished andesite slabs. just like that now in line with the top oak fence you're going to want to place a row of string connecting the two oak fences and then two rows behind it i placed that in the wrong spot and i yeah i did my goodness who is dropping boulders anyways bring these two red carpets backwards by two and you're going to create a pattern going left to right to right to left with white carpet, red carpet, white carpet, red carpet, white carpet, red carpet, white carpet. And it wants to go back by two rows. Find the middle polished andesite slab, which should be this one, and you want to turn it into a block. And the two left and two right want to also become blocks. And just like that. The now the middle three rows of this you want to place oak planks on top of it. I don't know if that it was necessary, but it is. Let me get up my picture so I can see what the fridge I am doing. Move upwards right up right diagonally with an oak plank. Go right one. Up diagonally by one. Up two. Up diagonally to the left one. Up one, up diagonally to the left one, left one, down diagonally to the left one, up diagonally to the left one, left one, down diagonally to the left one, down one, down diagonally to the left one, down two, down diagonally to the right one, and right by one. Oof, I start school tomorrow, which means I might start missing your streams. Oof. I start it next week, I believe. Now, take this middle oak plank and you're going to bring it downwards by three. It should be that one that's kind of sticking down from the west. 
<clears throat> Putting it left and right now by one, and down diagonally to either side by one. There is your little pretzel complete. Now, now I've got two pretzels in my world. <clears throat> okay. Now you can clear everything and get out. Cauldrons. Water bottles. Ooh, lever. Yeah, we need lever again. Red and white concretes. Light gray stained glass blocks. Oak fence. If I can find it. Yeah, we need that again, too. Lanterns. Where even are the lanterns? I'll find them. There they are. Stone brick stairs. And, okay. We need floor material. You also need smooth stone. So, come to the... Here, let me check something. Okay. Come to the front, or the back left corner, and you want to place a red concrete, then a white moving forward, red to the right, then a white, and then backwards with one red. Place a little light gray stained glass blocks on top of that, and you want to do the same pattern up on top. <coughs> you can get rid of your white concrete and get out smooth stone now. Not that it matters, but place a smooth stone down in the ground there. You want to place an oak fence in the middle just there so it should connect. And it kind of looks like the little racks that poke out that the pretzels just kind of sit on. And you want to place a red concrete to fill in the roof. You want to break the rest of the floor here and replace it with smooth stone. You should have made the pretzel out of brown wool. Or brown quartz. <laughs> Wish that was a thing. I should have, though. Or, like, brown concrete or something like that. But I just ended up going with oak. Should have done spruce. Spruce would have been better. Because I was, I was going to use slabs and stairs, but I decided against it because it kind of looked bad. Okay. Come to the back right corner and place a cauldron with a water bottle and a lever above it flicked down. Place a lever on the inside on this block so you can open and close your door. Take out a stone brick stair and you want to place it just kind of on the counter. And in the top corners you can place lanterns. Once you've done that, ladies and gentlemen, that was a very quick video, but that is your pretzel stand complete. Thank you guys for watching this video, and hopefully you guys did enjoy this video as I save this into the playlists as usual. Have a fantastic rest of your day or night, and I will see you on the next one. Peace!